Hey there, this is your Avon lady, Chris Arnold, and I have your product picks and preview for campaign 19 of 2019. And uh, this campaign, we are debuting yet another fantastic new lip color. Um, really our research and development in our, our color department is uh, really on its game this year. Um, so if you loved the lip tattoo a few campaigns ago, you're really uh, also going to like this one a lot. So this is our new Mattitude Soft Matte uh, Liquid Lip. And it comes in eight great colors, all with their own little attitude. And um, it's a feather light formula. Like really, seriously, you cannot feel it. It does not feel like there's anything on your lips at all. I actually had to um, stop and double check before I started the video to make sure I still had lipstick on. Um, it wears really, really well because it is a dry matte um, it is moisturizing, but it wears really well. Um, and I'm finding it's wearing very similar to the lip tattoo um, where it will will stay, you know, pretty much until I eat or drink something. And then it wears away kind of inside the top of the lip. Um, so I get sort of a soft ombre look there um, when that starts to wear away. Um, does It is moisturizing. It has um, poppy seed oil and vitamin E, so it's very um, nourishing and smoothing on the lips, very um, soft. Um, again, because it is a product that you don't have to reapply often, um, even with the moisturizing, you might feel a little dry, um, but I have had success with putting um, my lip balm over the top of it and not having it you know, wear any faster. Um, and you could also, if you don't necessarily want the matte but you like the color you could also um you know top it again with with a clear lip gloss or you can mix and match your favorite shades um and play up with that i haven't um haven't actually done that yet haven't played with the um you know topping the lip glosses with that um but i really feel like um like i would really like the resolute with the lip glow in splendor over the top so that's probably the first um kind of mashup of the matte and the lip glow that i might try um, and the reason you would want to do something like this, one, you can get your own unique custom color, um, but also it's you're going to get the longer wear of the matte with the high shine of the lip glow. So that'll and that would be why you would want to mix that. Um, so I did swatch all eight colors here and I'll put a picture at the end of the video, too, with the, the names next to them um, so that you'll be able to see those. But from top to bottom, we have uh, Devoted which is sort of a, a peachy pink medium tone there. Uh, we have, so that was this top one here. The next one down we have is Resilient, which you can see is kind of a, a purpley, um, deep plummy purpley color. And these are all just one swipe. Um, and you can see it looks very, very dark in the tube. But when you kind of look at where it at where it is on there you can see it's a little bit lighter shade it doesn't go on quite that dark um, and while i've got this open take off the excess here so you can see i'll show you the applicator it's it's a typical it's a doe foot applicator that's what we call these sponge tip um, lip gloss or um, liquid eyeshadow applicators but this one's got a little curve to it and it's really cool because it just kind of hugs your lip and very evenly um, coats the lip as you put it on and it does still have a little bit of a, a you know teensy bit of a point to the tip so that makes it great to kind of line around the edges and get a nice uh, nice clean line there or you can also kind of um, uh, blend it out a little bit and have a softer uh, softer lip there uh, next up we have driven and this is a super bright I think it's kind of a fuchsia bright pinky purple color there really really pretty then we have Tenacious, um, which is more of a brownish shade. You can see that one here. And it's um, it's, a, it's a, a warmer brown. It's not a real orange brown, um, but it's not really a pinky brown either. So it's a nice, uh, nice kind of neutral shade there. Let me see. And, um, and I do agree with um, a friend of mine pointed out that Ambitious is actually the nude color. <laughs> So um, I, we kind of thought it was funny. We figured ambitious would be something really bold and bright, like maybe this one. Um, but no, it's it's our um, kind of soft nude shade. Really, really pretty. Um, 
has just enough, it's, it's kind of a beigey color, but it's got just enough pink to it to give it that, that real um, natural, um, usually you don't think of pink giving it a warmth, but it gives it just a little bit of life, um, I think is how I would put it. So that's the ambitious, again, it's, it's a beigey color, but it's got a little bit of a pink to it. Um, I haven't had a chance to try that one. I just threw a couple of them in my, I got it just, got them just before I left to go to our annual rep fest or annual conference. And I just threw a couple of them in my bag um, to have while I was there. So I haven't had a chance to try all the colors yet. Um, but I think Ambitious will be the next one I try. Uh, next up is Relentless. And that is your bright red. And um, it is a little bit more of an orangey red, but not a real orange. Um, again, kind of like the brown, not a... Um, not a super orange, more of, more of a neutral red, but a little bit on the warm side. So that's the um, Relentless. Then we have Resolute, which this is absolutely my favorite color. And if you saw any of my pictures um, on social media from um, our RepFest conference, uh, most of the time I was wearing this. Um, I was one day, I was wearing it over the Renegade Ruby um, lip tattoo because I had put on the renegade ruby and then realized it didn't match it didn't it didn't go well with the bright pink shirt that I was wearing for our pink out of bourbon street that we did so I covered it with this because of course the lip tattoo you can't really take off if you change your mind um so I covered it with this so that would alter the color a little bit but most of the time um in uh, in New Orleans this is what I was wearing I don't think I wore any of the other lipsticks that I took with me um and that's this one here it's kind of a, a purpley shade but just a really really pretty nice mauve um, tone and then last but not least is persistent which is the shade that i have on today so you can see it's kind of a berry a berry red and again just a very very pretty shade so that is our uh, mattitude uh, soft matte liquid lip and again it's a feather light non-drying um, it has micronized pigments in it so you get a really really good color payoff on that um, with the poppy seed and vitamin E that helps uh, moisturize the lips. Um, I found it's not totally transfer resistant. If I drag my finger along my arm there, I get a little bit. So I am going to, unlike the lip tattoo, I am not going to be going around with the swatches on all day because I don't want to accidentally get any on my clothes. Um, <laughs> now I got to wash that off. So it's, it's not transfer resistant, but it is um, very long wearing. It's like I said, it's holding up um, really until I eat or drink and then um, it's still on the outside edge is still really holding uh, fairly well there so um, and I will say I already mentioned we had um, last weekend we had uh, rep fest which was is our uh, annual convention for Avon representatives we were in New Orleans Louisiana so we um, spent some time down on Bourbon Street as a group we had a big um, pink out of Bourbon Street and it was really cool because it was also like a white out party going on where you know where everybody wears like the white linen and stuff so they were all going one direction as we were all going the other it was really fun it was just this big sea of pink going one way and big sea of white going the other um, so that was that was a lot of fun um, and I got to see so many new products that are coming out um, for the rest of 2019 including some really great um, collaborations with the face shop um, which if you don't know um, Avon is going to is, is being purchased by LG health and home which is their um, most people in the US know LG as um, an electronics company but they also have a health and home um, branch of their of their company and they have bought Avon North America so Avon US Avon Canada and um, Avon Puerto Rico and so they are bringing some of the great brands that they have had um, based out of Korea for um, for many years so we're, we're collaborating with those brands and bringing those brands to you through your friendly neighborhood Avon representative um, so I will be um, sharing some previews of those products um, and then, of course, as they launch, you'll see them here in the product picks and preview. But if you want to see like the very first looks of them, like this morning, I posted um, a video of trying out one of the new cleansers. So as I'm trying each of the new products, I'm doing a little video about them as I try them. And I'm sharing those in my um, private um, VIP group um, for customers and or anyone that, that is interested in the products. Um, but no representatives, sorry. Um, Thoughts on Beauty on Facebook. So if you just search Thoughts on Beauty, you'll find that. You'll know it's me. It's got, you know, an Avon cover photo and, and all of that. Um, and you can request to join that group to get those first looks um, at those products. Um, so uh, next up, 
we have one of my all-time favorite products um, that just got kind of a new look. So, of course, we just recently released our Magix Tint, and we've had our Magix, we've called it our Magix Face Perfector, um, but it's gotten a new look and a new branding. Still the same great formula, but now it's going to be called Magix Prime because this is kind of our primer, um, but it really is more than a primer. It has your SPF 20 sunscreen, um, so you can have that extra layer of sunscreen, and it can be used when you're not wearing makeup. So it's great under your makeup to help extend the wear. It helps to smooth out pores and lines and give you a nice smooth texture to apply your foundation over. But you can also wear it by itself because it helps to blur imperfections and gives you just a little bit, um, a, a little bit softer look to your skin when you're not wearing makeup. Um, so it's it's Magic's Prime, and I just absolutely love this stuff because I get very shiny by the end of the day. This helps keep that at bay. Um, it's I love the new package because like the Magic's Tint, it's a flip top, so it's easier to use. And um, it's a soft white. Um, that's actually way more than I need for the back of my hand. I will tell you that, so a little goes a long way. Um, it's a soft white cream. Um, it's actually kind of got almost like a whipped texture and it blends out clear, um, but just softens up the look of the skin fills in any lines and pores, gives you a smooth surface and blurs any discolorations or imperfections, makes them a little softer, doesn't cover them, doesn't hide them, but just makes them a little less obvious. Um, and it has a very, very silky feel to it if you're using it by itself and not putting anything over the top of it. Um, so that's the Magix Prime, again, one of my all time favorite products. Um, there might even be a 60 second spotlight of it. Um, I'm pretty sure I did one at some point. Um, so if you look in the 60 second spotlight playlist, you might find even more about that. Uh, let's see. Another returning favorite from um, last year when we launched our new um, seasonal bath and body products with the that are um, infused with the premium fragrance oils. Um, this was the most popular scent last fall. So this is the one that we brought back for this fall. And it is the Autumn Berry Twist. And it's um, the scent of blackberries, pomegranate, and amber spice. And a nice, big, very generous sized, this is an eight ounce tube of the uh, body cream. We also have the um, fragrance mist and the shower gel that we had last year. And we've also added the hand cream for this year. So um, again, it's, it's blackberries, pomegranate, and amber spice. It's just a really, really fall scent. It's, it's very much like, so if you're one of those people I know that they're like, if summer can't get over fast enough, I want fall here now pick up some autumn berry twist and you're going to get that sense of, of fall. And um, I'll show you here. I'm doing this left-handed, so hopefully I don't make a mess. It's a very, um, it's in, in a tube, so it, you, you know, would think it would be more like a lotion, but it is um, a very rich emollient cream, very, very moisturizing um, with that lovely, lovely scent. And again, you can layer that with the shower gel and the body, the body mist so that you get um, you know, a longer lasting scent, but very, very um, luxuriant feeling um, lotion and, and shower gels in that. So that's our seasonal scent for, uh, for fall. Let's see, next up, oh, we have um, some uh, new things in our Shop for a Cause for our um, in, Inspire, Empower, and Support and these products um, to help raise money and we uh, support the National Domestic Violence Hotline. So, you know, we're on a mission to encourage healthy relationships for women everywhere. And um, a pro portion of the sales of all of these products go toward that um, through the Avon Foundation. And this is just a beautiful ring. It's got um, little um, CZ, let's see, are they CZs? Or are they? Yeah, they are CZ accents. Just wanted to double check. Um, CZs on the side and kind of a little pave effect and the beautiful purple stone. And it's got almost kind of like a little, um, it's not a straight band. It's got kind of that pinched look in there. I forget. Okay, I couldn't remember which finger I got it to fit. Pretty sure it was this one. That's actually a little loose. So I think I did get it to go on this finger. Um, really, really pretty. Good size, not not super dainty, not super big, just a nice everyday everyday ring. And of course, I love it in the purple, um, and the fact that it supports a good cause at the same time. 
is a bonus. So let's see. Then we have um, our our back page special this time is some leafy leaf, lovely leaf cluster earrings. You knew I was going to mess up something I said while I was on this video. The lovely leaf cluster earrings. And I picked them up in this silver tone just because I'm, you know, kind of a silver tone girl. And it's three different sizes kind of layered together. And it's almost got like a, um, it's almost got like a diamond cut look to them. Um, you can see, let's see if I can turn that sideways there. You can see about, you know, very light, very lightweight and thin, very leaf-like. Um, and every time we get something in a leaf motif, it's always a big hit, whether it's a necklace, earrings, whatever it is, um, always a great deal and always, um, always very popular. So these are, are super pretty. And you can see just how much motion they have. Um, they've almost got kind of a waterfall effect um, when you have them on and the way they catch the light. So I uh, love those. And last but not least, as always, our A box for Campaign 19. And always um, $10 with any $40 purchase from the campaign. We have our Crave uh, lip gloss. And that is in the Pumpkin Latte. So that's kind of the the reddish brown shade. We've got our velvet travel spray, our eau de parfum travel spray, our um, trial size or travel size of our power serum, which is you know a great addition to any skincare regimen, the power serum. Put that on first, it boosts the effects of everything else that you use after it. And a beautiful A-Box exclusive necklace. This is the Modern Glimmer Pendant Necklace, and it has a faux druzy stone set in gold tone. So you can see that there. I did not pick that up ahead of time, though, so I don't have it here to show. But um, but it is an A-Box exclusive, but only $10 with any $40 purchase. So it's a great deal. I mean, the necklace alone um, would be valued at more than $10. And then you get the fragrance, the lip gloss, and the um, skincare as a bonus. So um, that is all I've got for you for campaign 19. Uh, be sure to join the Thoughts on Beauty group on Facebook um, if you want to get those sneak peek first looks at all of the, um, the great new products that Avon gave us a sneak peek of at our um, Rep Fest last year. And you know, if, if Rep Fest and a Bourbon Street takeover and hanging out, I've got friends at our annual conference that I've been hanging out with for 20 years. Um, so you know, it's not just about the products it's about the friendships that you make and and lifelong uh friendships so you know if uh, if this seems like some fun that you'd like to get in on next year we will be in san antonio um and along the river walk there so that is um, going to be just loads of fun um you know if you'd like to know a little bit more about getting in on this avon thing shoot me a message i'd be happy to share with you i uh, hope you're all having a wonderful wonderful day and i will see you again in a couple weeks